Hey, what's going on? This is Rob from Panther Vision and welcome to a new episode of What Else Can You Do With Your Logo. Today we're gonna do the IBM effect. Uh, you know, basically we got the lines going on. The lines are going to be thick on the top, thin on the bottom, and you can do multiple stuff with it. I'm gonna show you these effects, how they're done. Let me put this right here. So anyways, I gotta move these up. Um, wait, 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 I gotta delete this. Okay, I'm gonna work with this text. You can select yours, you can select uh, whatever name you want. And from here, we're gonna create a line, a thicker line right here. Something around this length. I gonna recolor it to white gonna create a new line press and hold alt drag it press shift and pull it right, right here in the bottom and I'm gonna make this thin I'm gonna move it somewhere around this area but anyways after this we can change where to move this and all that stuff go to object click on blend click on make as you can see it added a dozens of lines I'm gonna go here to the blend tool double click Select specify steps, decrease the number of the lines until you're gonna see some distances going up between uh, them. Gonna click OK. Uh, OK, if you wanna see, I just forgot to say, I, this one is on 13. Uh, you can experiment with different values. Uh, I also gonna experiment with this more. I gotta pull this down this area and I'm going to make this top top line thinner because right now it's like really thick you don't understand what it's written there so i'm gonna double click on this line double click click again on this press and hold alt and just as you can see if you uh, make this thinner the all the lines are going to make you know become more thin this one is pretty legit as you can see here it's uh, not enough so i'm gonna pull this zone yeah, sound like that. And I also think I'm also thinking to add some more lines in between. So I'm gonna go back here to the blend tool, double click, increase the numbers. And it start to become more and more appealing. I'm gonna click OK. There you go. Yeah. This might be a little bit better. Let me pull this more up. I don't know. Yeah, something like this. So it's gonna start with black, the black line. Let me, wait, okay. There you go. And it's gonna end up here. Bingo. And you also can do some more interesting edits. Okay. For example, you select it, I double click on this line and I select the direct selection tool from here. Select these two anchor points and you can pull this and it's gonna edit, you know, the whole thing. So basically I'm gonna do it vice versa like this. So it looks like some laser stuff going on. I don't know, some laser effect. Actually, this is going to ruin it, so it's not a good idea. But you get the main idea, you know, it's a nice effect. So yeah, this is it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you get notified of daily updates. Check out the other videos as well and have a good one. Bye-bye.